soon as possible. I try my best, but it's not so easy to make the tournament go and make the stream go fast. It's not so easy. But it works until now, I would say. I hope it is working also for you guys that are on looking lurking and looking at the stream. But it's it's fine, it's fine. Uh, now we will wait to do deck lists, but they are arriving, I think. But the first okay, it's the okay, it's the Dark Depths deck. Um, I don't remember the name of the guy with the Dark Depths deck, but I will see it later. Uh, and the other guy is, oh, White Blue Fetch and Black Blue Fetch. Hmm. I saw Mentor as well. I think it's Miracles. Do you think Miracles? Okay. Because either Miracles or Blue Eyes, Stone Blade. And this is an extremely good start for the Depths player with the uh, turn one of a Simon Spirit Guide um, Sylvan Library, which he can abuse completely versus the. Yeah, it's great against this deck. The Miracles deck. Yeah, yeah I think it's Miracles. Yeah, That's looking it. at the card now, I would say it's yeah, Miracles. Probably. This <laughs> will be an interesting game, <laughs> I would say. It can be a really interesting game also because Water Push is, is really good against the Depths. Yep. But at the same time, he has uh, the Discard against, but at the same time, there is the Snapcaster in this way. <laughs> it will not be over soon. Yeah. But interesting choice here. What do you take? Do you take the Swords? Do you take the Snappy? Do you... It depends a lot on his hand. Yeah, on that's the true. Dark Depths hand. I think it's. Okay, I saw a Pitting Needle. Pitting it is so good against Jace. I think I would consider Jace as an option uh, if Pitting Needle was not there. Um, really? I, I could think about it. Okay. Because it depends if your opponent has the way to enable it at the end of your turn when you cast the, the Jace. Because, because you want to get you want to get back to the uh, to the cards that you are losing from the library at the moment. Mm -hmm. it, but I feel like what? Okay. Well, yeah, for sure you go. Wait, you go mentor. Second. Okay. Or black, black. Okay. There's a where we are. Black, black. Okay. So we have the deck list, and it, it is indeed Ubi blue, white, red, and miracles. miracles. Yeah, red is just for the. Pyroblasts and Red Elemental Brass from the sideboard. It's, yeah, the, I feel like this is kind of a classic list, it yep. seems. Yeah, it's kind of, what I'm asking myself is kind of an overkill to have three Volcanic Islands if you only have like the four Red Blasts in the sideboard. It is, but I think. Uh, or, or better, it is not, maybe. He tested more than us. But it feels like uh, not all blue decks are uh, Westland decks. This way, it feels like Maybe two Volcanic Island could have been enough. I don't know. Right. You know, but he is not playing uh, back to basics and. No Blood Moon either. He will suffer a little bit of the back to basics with yeah. this, but just a little bit. Okay, the Miracles is Pascal Richter. Pascal Richter. Oh, okay, I know him. He's, he's playing quite. Wait, 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 one second, one second. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, type yeah, in. yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. And the other player is the rather difficult name. Rakotoarison Gil. Yeah, we saw him winning versus the Burn deck. Yeah. That's the guy we already saw. Also. Right. I recognize him. Right. Regarding the thoughts, again, I'm, like, I, in, in, from my perspective, I would just take as many swords away as possible because yeah, it the, makes sense. The game's gonna sense. take ages, and this is so good that he can could he did DK the wait yeah there's a DK he did DK the mentor. Yeah, I agree with you. I agree with you that uh, that taking out. I'm not sure. 
I think Snapcaster is better than yeah. Sword. I would have taken the yeah. Snapcaster. I think that's that's what. Like, if you want to go for mana efficiency, yeah. of course you take the Sword, but just take the two two and body away because like this is going to be a longer game. You're not going to kill him with the first two body against the Sylvan Rivalry is something. Yeah, it's something real. Yeah, there, there's a clock. Uh, he's a nine <laughs> this way. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. He abused it really already. I love Sylvan Rivalry. I would also abuse about it a bit, but at the same time, I, I think the Snapcaster could do just an insanely good work in this yeah. game. Yeah, and he has enough mana as well to use it. So now we see, uh, hopefully, there, there was a needle you said before, right? So yep. we should see a needle coming down uh, on the chase. Because if not, if not, if not <laughs> the game is almost over again, we yeah. see him brainstorming like twice, three times, and then he has all the answers. Yeah, that was a little bit my my issue with Jace. Yeah. If he had no needle. Yeah. Just because I, I do see that now. Because if you have no uh, threat to go off at the end of your turn with a hex mage, yep. it is really uh, rough having a Jace into play that yeah, comes back from yes. the card disadvantage that card disadvantage that you got from library. Very true. That, that is very true. But it is true that he has Needle and he has also the Hex Mage against Jace. Yes. For Hex, ma Hex Mage, if, if you do not know, it, it says sacrifice this creature and remove all counters from target permanent. So either you can remove the 10 counters from Dark Depths or you can kill any Planeswalker actually by removing all the counters from it. It's a Planeswalker killer. It's, it's actually... It is an interaction <laughs> that does come up quite a bit if you play against the deck, yeah. and if you if you're not used to it, you play sometimes you're playing Swalker into it, and they just say, "Okay, I could uh, prince Swalker," and uh, <laughs> can hurt, can hurt quite a bit. Yeah, I can see that. Now let's see. So, yeah, can't trip in a way. Can't trip in a way. There's and still three cards in his hand, and the card that he is drawing with the Priority. Yes, and he has three mana for a Snappy as well, uh, plus a Sword. Um, so yeah, next next turn we presumably going to see the first, the first uh, 2020, which will be sorted, I guess, by Snappy, and then. Oh, uh, uh, there's a click. When, it, in which moment are we? We we're in his main phase, I think. Okay. And he clicks himself to get rid of Chase. Where's the, where did the Snappy go? Did we miss? Lol. Uh, oh, there's a mistake. There's, he saw an extra card probably or something. We're going to have a charge call, I presume. Yeah, I feel <laughs> he didn't sew it, looking how he, he acted. Yeah. But, yeah, it, there was the possibility to see. I kind of saw it, but he was really fast. Yeah, he play he plays it fast. That's true. So I think they're discussing with the church right now. We don't see over there, but um, yep. Anyways, I think Miracle's very good position now. Um, yeah. If he somehow like does he it. play a council's judgment? I like the list with accumulated knowledge. I am a big fan. Accumulated Just knowledge. Yeah, the new list of miracles that the place accumulated knowledge four the, of the yeah <laughs> yeah I mean if you, you, you one. <laughs> <laughs> it's just it, it uses a lot of space right yeah it is uh, it is the South American guys uh, that have played the last GP Salvato and so on oh okay uh, one oh, okay. of them played the last round against uh, Ryu yeah and I. I played on Friday on Magic Online against Salvato. Yeah. That uh, is a pro South American pro player. Yeah, and, I know. Um, and he was playing this deck, and I lost against him uh, with uh, Legend Shadow. A sort of brush. It's, it's so mean. It's, 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 <laughs> it's yeah, so it's a mean card against Death Shadow. It's really mean. It's so mean. Uh, but yeah, at, at the end I lost. But he was playing for Accumulated Norwich, and this is a card that I love. <laughs> this is just a card that I love. I used to play it in Oath, like way back. Yeah. In Oath, it's. Yeah, when it's still Dark insane. Steel. <laughs> when, when the best thing you could get was Dark Steel Colossus. Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, you draw a lot of cards with, with, uh, with it. It's actually an interesting approach. Yeah, I feel that's the approach where you want to beat like Grixis, and it feels like Accumulated Norwich is, is insane against Grixis. Yeah. Wow. I'm still. Like, he must have brainstormed the Snappy away. No, the Zerafcaster is in the grave. 
Where, with how did he end up? Did he have a second thought sees which we missed? Okay, may, maybe. We missed something, guys. Sorry. <laughs> Name Nazi. What? Do we have a admin in the chat? You know that? Yes, or are we you admin? Are admin. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but that's... I made myself admin, and this is my account of Twitch. Okay. Right. And, yeah, uh, the, the Snappy was not in his hand anymore. He had the DK for the click, and then it came to 2020, and the first one actually yeah. did. I never would have thought that, that it was that quick yeah. still. Like, yeah. I feel like he had the... At the end, I feel like the library was insane. The library won the game, for sure. Yeah. yeah. I, I'm still asking myself... <laughs> What happened to the Snapcaster? <laughs> this way we have to get back on that. I don't know exactly what happened. Oh, we will find out. What? We will find out after the game. I will ask him. How could you? It was a second thought. He's, it must have been earned yeah. acquisition. Else it, it wasn't possible, really. Um, yeah. You took away the, the sword closure at first. Yeah, this was the very first one. Oh, well, maybe... The same turn he did two of them? I don't know. Also possible. No, there was a fetch land in between the two cards. This way. I don't know. True. All right. What do we have Let's for sideboarding? Let's see the sideboard. Let's see the sideboards. Okay. Containment Priest doesn't work against this. Nope. And uh, then there is Disenchant is nothing. Sulfur Elemental is nothing. Fluster Storm is nothing. Pyroblast is nothing, Red Elemental Blast is nothing, Surgical Extraction is nothing. Mm. Okay. Um, surgical? I think Do you like it? I like Surgical because, like, especially post no, you will you will handle the first one and then you just extract the, the depths and he his only out is to hit you with uh, Dark Confidence. And yeah. Uh, I, I'm not a big fan of Surgical as, a, as this plan, but I, I can see that. Uh, and I think you have enough depth. The, depth the problem cards. is you have that cards. This way I can totally agree with you. You have Terminus is not great, I think. No. But maybe leaving maybe two, but two, yeah, because of the confidence. Yes. You have to keep some of them. I he didn't see them though, but he, he might suspect them. Like they used to play a lot of uh, bobs in the I, in the sideboard. I side would bar. take out probably ter two engineer exclusives. Does he have two main? I didn't even see yeah, that. Okay, main. yeah, two EE, I would I would take as well. this out uh, two EE for two surgical. I can see that. Uh, for the rest, I would not. Um, disenchant maybe for the needles and for the library. Yeah, disenchant is good. You're right. You're and then totally maybe maybe right cut cut a couple of force of wills. Either I force of wills or predicts. Count. Predicts you can I maybe cut. I would cut. never cast <laughs> force of will in this matchup. I understand why, because the discard is... Uh, but I feel like... You want to have a card like this in your deck against Yeah, this. you you want it, but at the same time, like you don't want to force you the hex mage. You want him to use all his resources yeah, to make I the twenty twenty, then answer but, the twenty twenty. You want to force if you don't have those water blowers. Yeah, you yeah. You want yeah. to force a confident yeah, as yeah. an example. That's uh, very true. That's yes. very true. Uh, I think the disenchant is right. I feel like taking out a terminus for sure for a disenchant. I right. don't know if I would take out something else like for the second one. Like, take out two EEs, a Terminus, and then, like, maybe one Surgical only, because, like, one can really be good. You don't, you never want to see a second one, I do agree. But, like, if you Surgical the Dark yeah. Depths, you win. You, yeah. you have one, basically. And that's how, yeah, three cards, and then cut, like, two EEs and a Terminus. Could be yeah. good. Yeah, I'm still thinking about it. About also what you said before, about the Forge Wheels. I don't know. Yeah, uh, I feel maybe. <laughs> no, I I like the the first disenchant for sure. I'm not sure about it. maybe maybe it's still uh, cutting the another terminus and keeping an explosives is better maybe. Mm -hmm. Just because explosives is a good answer also to beating needle. Yeah, it kills pissing needle. It yeah. kills library. Um, it kills bobs. It yeah. kills the hex mages. Yeah, maybe True. yeah, maybe disenchant and. Uh, the only problem is maybe you you bring in one disenchant because you he could name him. he has three pentagon in the middle. He could name EE, e -E, but e wow. And okay, this, he has a lot of discard. He could see it, yeah. and then, yeah, yeah, okay, that's true. I can see that. That's true, and he plays like three needles, right? Uh, yeah, it's seven rounds in total, yeah. exactly. Seven round Lotus Magic. 
it's round number six and there are seven rounds in total i can update you yes. on some ticino players that are still there in uh, the, uh, because i know lotus magic is from ticino uh, there is still uh, some three one ones a four one no two four ones and two four uh, three one ones in contention of the right. italian part of switzerland yeah el ticino and the players we're currently watching, I know that Pascal is uh, currently 4 own one so uh, okay. no loss. And then I assume Gilles is either in the same or okay, is 5 okay. now as well. Or I not like or 5 now. He has no draws. Yeah, most likely. <laughs> <laughs> most likely. I don't <laughs> think this is a deck that most should likely. take draws. Most but likely. maybe, you know. All right. Um, for his sideboarding as well, he has quite a few things. Um, Broken Bone could be an option because of uh, counterbalance and stuff. Choke I would bring in 100% just because it bashes the Miracles player. Um, Dread of Night I could see for the Mentor, but you don't really need it. It's more no for DNT. He doesn't have any at all, no. right? <clears throat> okay. Question is if he knows that. Yeah. <clears throat> then the Golgari Charm I don't think you need. Graphic stage, no. Lilian of the Last Hope could be a threat, but I don't see the value really. And you can get back a Bob, but he's only playing two anyways. Also, sur surgical on uh, Swartoblush. Yeah, Surgicals I would bring in, yeah. Um, and then Riot of Consumption. Nah. I don't think so. You leave in the DKs to kill to kill his clicks. Yeah, it's such a bad card in your hand if you, yeah. <laughs> if you don't get it. Yeah, true. If you don't get there. That's very true. And then he can <laughs> maybe cut the ranker, I don't know. Although it's actually good to get through the clicks. <laughs> um, someone safekeeper, he definitely leave in, I don't know, probably excavator you could cut because you're not going to get the val land value train, most likely. Mm, does he um, plays Loam? He or? plays also Westland or uh, one Westland or something like this? No, no? he doesn't. No. One goes quarter. He, could, goes he quarter. could, he could, I mean, usually they played like two planes. And then the three Tundras. Yeah, you could get him the White Blends. But that takes a lot of time. Yeah. It takes That's it. probably too much time. And yeah, you yeah, had to get right of consumption, what you think? Uh, I don't think it's useful. You don't, like, you just attack, right? Yeah. I, I feel like you cannot have uh, cards that are win more. Also, if maybe... It, well, uh, the, the point is, like, if you cast it and the sacrificing is uh, is part of the cost, you can completely try out swords or any removal yeah, on the thing. Yeah, for sure. But then you're very susceptible to counters. <laughs> yeah, uh, if you get countered, you are, like, ah, yeah. Yeah. dead. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah, I can see your point, but at the same time, I'm, like, mm. Probably not, no. I, I, like, yeah, from my intuition, I wouldn't take them in as well. I will, yeah. I would update the score. That would be a good thing, I think. <laughs> Let's do that. Hmm. What happens now? Okay. Uh, Toxas was done on the water blushers. Uh, Sylvan okay. Safekeeper in his, is in his hand. Oh, Pitting Needle comes out. Fetch and response, yeah. which is wise. <laughs> yeah. Like this it has happens happened to people. It a lot. Oh. Oh, you can name that. Oh, pretty yeah. cool. <laughs> yeah. 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 It can be very frustrating if you miss yeah. if you miss it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see that. And you get your fetch lands on the table without doing anything. And maybe you draw three more of them. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. As it happens. Punishing. As it happens sometimes. And there's the safekeeper. <coughs> this one is is quite good, I think. Uh, yeah, I can see that. This one's quite now, good. Now counters become a lot better than sword brochures, but he has boat. Oh no, it's a disenchant, I would say. Yes. Yeah. So he brought it in. Okay. Yeah, it's a disenchant. And he's thinking if end step disenchant is worth it, probably. Oh. He forces the safekeeper. Interesting. Yeah. It's interesting. Yeah. He's right because he drew the water blushers. You know, that's the classic how way how to be right. <laughs> it cannot be wrong <laughs> if you draw this water blushers. Definitely not. Uh, I'm not sure about this counter. I can see it, I can understand it, but I'm not sure about right. the counter on safekeeper. Right. 
But drawing the Zwartu Blushers, it is completely right to counter the Safe Keeper. Yeah, he had a Snappy as well, no? There's the clock, and he interesting, he... Um, sorry? He, he had a Snappy, are you sure? I think he has a Snappy in hand, but I'm okay. not sure. Maybe I'm mistaken. No, you're right. You're okay, right. good. Um, and interesting, he fetched for the Urborg and not for the Dark Depths, and now is playing... This is confusing. Why didn't he get a Dark Depths? What is he playing around? Like he played a Sylvan Scry and got the yeah. the Urborg last turn, played it really fast. Um, and now? Casts a Hex Mage, okay. Uh, okay. I'm thinking if he confused the Trespian stage with the Dark Depths now. But he has the crop rotation, it makes a little bit yeah, but then I, I saw that. I thought he wanted he want to be able to double activate for some reason, but now he's tapping the Thespian stage. So I don't really get it, but we'll see. I can see that. Because he has the... I think he wants to try to trick the situation, I feel. All right. He wants to trick his opponent. Wait. Does it say... Uh, the labyrinth of it says unblock a creature, right? Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, he will try, I feel, yeah, he will try it. I think you should resolve. If he makes a token, you sort it. You get, you get like, the hex match dies, you get um, monk tokens, and then you can start really go off um, the turn after. Like, if you have any cantrips or something, or a chase, then you just, you just go nuts. Yeah. I'm thinking... Yeah, I can understand this. I don't know if I would do it. If uh, I mean, if he lets him do the take take the land, I would not sacrifice X Mage. Yes, that's very think. that's a very good point. That's a very very good point. This way. So you don't you don't put the one does, for two there. Does he have other lands that do something? Not in the current situation, I think. Mm, no. It's interesting. And Poskolovsky's ring is a very long thought if he wants to force it or not. <laughs> I'm thinking, what does? If he attacks with a mentor and he blocks with the hex mage, what does Pascal do? Um, cast a sword on the hex mage after the block. Yeah. Okay, then I uh, I make the crop rotation and you have to force a will. Yeah. I yeah I was greedy to attack. I agree. He should, I, I don't think he should have attacked there. He could play the disenchant if he has it in the... I think he has it. Oh, true. But then he still cannot sword it because he has yeah. only one white. He cannot sword, but he can force. But true. I would not... I think it, it was better not to attack. <laughs> in, in all this, I think it was better not. Also because <laughs> the labyrinth <laughs> was there this way. Yeah. Uh, I feel... Yeah, you could tap he, one of his mana this way, but... Right. Okay, this is what you said happened. He didn't counter, and the depth is there. And he didn't use the hex much easier, what you said. Yeah. Which is wise, probably. Which is rather wise. <laughs> I, w I would say without probably, <laughs> <laughs> because it was pretty punishing having two cards less in the battlefield at the moment. Yes. And one of them gives mana, and that's yes. pretty good. Yes. And then she's a 2 1 first striker. It's a really good creature. I love Vampire Hex match. I think it's a really cool card. And if you use the Trespian stage, you can copy now the... Like, what? Oh, yes, he right. It. And what we say it happened. And there's a Force of Will. Force of Will. Wow, he's moving really fast. He must have given... Like, he must have been really sure. 
and he thinks there's no for he thought so long about the crop rotation you have there must be something right but okay interesting mm, i think i you could have smelled the force of will there i think i would never do the play like this <laughs> <laughs> yeah maybe maybe no well, I don't. now he gets tokens but if he copied the the just interaction that I don't have a lot. Mm -hmm. If he comes in with Trespian stage, the the depths. Yes. The Trespian stage dies or the depths dies. Um, the Thespian stage goes in the grave. Becomes becomes dark depths. Then yeah. you choose because of the legendary yeah. rule. So the dark depths goes in the grave, and then you get the trigger on the stage. Okay. And the trigger uh, says sacrifice dark depths. Then you sacrifice the dark depths, which is a Thespian stage, and you get both okay. in the grave so eventually. You don't get to keep the, the Dark Depths. You don't have a way to keep them. No. Now he gets an Excavator, which is an excellent draw. But there is the, the Swords, right? I think you Swords that Excavator right away. No. He doesn't? Okay. No, he has Excavator and Water Blusher. I think he had to play the... the nah. I think now he just has to not take risks. Because there is still the depth. Yeah. This way, and the stage. This way, you cannot sword. Yeah, and he gets through the two damage. Yeah. Wow, if he blocked there and forced out the sword. No, no he would have played disenchant. Still. Yeah, you're correct. <laughs> I forget about this. That's why he attacked like this. Choking. Oh. Wow, can disenchant he swing this around? Disenchant is there. Can he win this? Disenchant is still there. True. <laughs> no way out. But now he has to cast it, like at a certain point, uh, if he wants to ever tap out again. I would have tapped. I would have played the disenchant and the previous turn. It does increase your clock, so. But if you draw a, a draw spell of any type, yeah, you you can get in for like you, too many damage. Yeah, you go, you go nuts. That's so crazy. Oh, there's a second needle. Needle, 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 needle. Okay, but it is there. <laughs> Wait, this way it's maybe closer. Let us know, guys, if like the sound is not good or something. Just write it in the chat, or if anything else you would like to feedback. Um, whoa, we're happy okay. to get it. Safekeeper is great at this point, right? Yes. Did you just? It's cast insane. It? Yeah. Okay. That is probably game. Yeah, like I don't know his the complete hand of Pascal, but it's a disenchant and his word. He has to disenchant, choke, make the token defense. He's at seventeen. <sighs> he could <sighs> no, that doesn't make sense. It's really hard to get him, and yeah, like, he, he has just too many lands as well. Um, the the dark Death player. Does he have a brainstorm? Uh, I think so. No ponder. ponder. Okay, uh, also good. Now yeah. the Terminus and the Rainstorm would be quite convenient. Why is the token not in play? Uh, did you forget? <laughs> ah. Yeah, yeah. It's a bit late. Yeah, yeah. He, <laughs> he did keep. Uh, yeah. He's going to make a ton of tokens. Really useful tokens. <laughs> yes. <laughs> What is he digging for? I can see Engineer is the exclusive for being the best card. Can if he, he has another land. If he has another land, yeah. yeah. But that's another reason to keep in the exclusives. I think uh, you should keep both of them. Or click. He's, he could be digging for a click as well to give him an extra turn. Yeah. Now it's a lot of damage. Huh? Yeah, what is it? Like three, um, it's three, six, ten? Ten, ten at already. The it can also just go balls and swords on the blocker. Wow. What's happening? Okay. I don't know. He's casting another. Okay. Ponder? Ponder again. Or still? Or that was weird. Okay, that was super weird. About what? 
like how he did that with the ponder because he's not that this is not the third ponder this is still the other one right it's the second one no no it's the second one and he he didn't use the second one okay i don't know why they were checking something i don't know exactly what but yeah it would be so, like so good to have to talk but yeah probably it would be too disturbing as well at a certain point yeah i don't know i think you could have them in the headset yeah yep. So. Would make sense. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, there's still room to improve, as always. You should OP. OP. Nerf. Nerf Lucia. The Goku tokens are pretty funny. They're nice. <laughs> They are nice. With the boiler and everything. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Let's see. Does he make the token? Does he has four lock? lands now. If you make the token... Oh, no. Jace is not an issue. It's this no. way... Oh, and you have the safety. Yeah, he has three. Like, he needs to have three he swords. He tops one less than what he should, I think. Okay. There you now go. Now it's fine. No, wait. No, I think he tapped one less than he should. Right? Um, no, I don't think so. I think okay, he, he had he tapped the stage and the Urborg, which is oh two. yeah, yeah, yeah. You, because he can tap the, the the depths for mana. Sorry, not the, the stage, the, the depths, the for, depths mana. for mana. You're totally right. You are totally right. Uh, what is? <laughs> yeah, what swords is fell off. <laughs> uh, rather. Well, just one source is not enough, I think, right? He needs to click. What does he have? He needs Swords and, and, and the blue card. He needs I think. that, like, his two cards could be, like, four Zwartu Blushers. That's an option. It could be, yeah. And the second option is. Brainstorm into card drawing into Terminus. Right. The other options are. I don't know. You know what he could do? He could sort his own mentor. He's at 17. He could sword the mentor. That's get like make another token, get another get another token. Yeah, I feel like this is the only play you can do. You're right. It's five li five lives. You go to 22. You have yeah, you have jump you, you blockers. Could, you could also win on I don't know how many I don't know if he is at 17. Yeah, it is possible because the the labyrinth was always there. Yeah, yeah. He has three Vendillion clicks. He lets the mentor die. Okay. Oh, there is also the Council's judgment that could be really good at this point. True, very true. That is very true. I think Does he that have it? He, he tapped three mana before. That was like that could be the best draw. No, it's a click. We get another turn. He didn't do it on himself. No, he did do it on his opponent. His opponent just didn't show his cards. Is it not better on yourself? He has a sword. Yeah, what do you do with the sword? Sure. Like, if you didn't sort your mentor, why? So he found the click mark. He's playing three, by the way. I know that. Yeah, three of them. Yeah. What is he searching He's going to get a Satiri step and then he wins the game. What? Uh? Sajiri step. Um, oh, the protection. Land. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and gives a protection from color, gives some protection yeah, yeah. from blue, swings in. Uh, He's this really this hasty. Gives shroud? Yes. Right? Yes. This way so if he should sword play sword. Oh my god. Oh my god. Think about it. Block. Please, please <laughs> think about it, dude. <laughs> Limited oh my players. god. <laughs> That's so true. He could just sword the blushers. Yeah, I have thought about this as well because, like, sometimes <laughs> it's tricky yeah. if you if you want to give yourself. Or I I thought about. Yeah. Wow. Uh, I thought about Whoa, using it in wait. infect. He no, would have seen nothing. It's a draw card drawing. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, he would have drawn the snap. It would have been so good. The sword of blushers on the. I think it gives shroud because there. Was does it no target? Is the other question. 
What does it target? If uh, if so, Shiri. Yeah, yeah, it, it does. There is no other option. Yeah, it targets. It targets. It's not like so choose a creature you control against protection from. Okay. I don't have to wording you. Uh, I don't think so. But no, no, uh, I, I think it's it's uh, targeting. I'm pretty sure. There are really few cards that do things like that, and I don't think it's one of them. I played that card a little bit, but Sajiri. Okay, the game is to end. It is two zero two for no. duck, dark, duck, duck depths. Dark depths. Duck depths.